If you've been enjoying our journey, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the bell to get notifications for our future videos. Hello again. So we are on another bus. Uh, well, we're heading from Gweru to Victoria Falls. And we started at 11... 11 o'clock. Yeah, 11 o'clock today. And we actually thought we had missed the bus because when we were driving to the bus stop, um, we saw a stallion cruise bus pass us. So we were pretty scared that that was our bus. But anyway, we phoned the lady and she's like, no, the bus is still coming. So we waited. We were supposed to get on at 10, but anyway, it eventually came at 11. And we went on that bus. Yeah, and to Bulawayo. Yeah, got to Bulawayo. And then we had to change buses in Bulawayo. Yeah, but let me just tell you what happened. So we're literally sitting on the bus, and like almost every passenger gets off the bus. And like Lance, myself, and then maybe one or two other people were there. So the guy says, okay, we're going to have a 10 minute recess. So we're chilling and everything, and then Lance says, maybe I should just go check if we're supposed to change buses or if this is going to Victoria Falls. So he goes and checks, and the guy just speaks Shauna back to him. So he has absolutely no idea what's going on. <laughs> but then you followed him, and he like pointed to another bus and told Lance to take his bags. So Lance quickly runs and calls me and says, we have to move. So they <laughs> literally like grab all our stuff. Ran across the bus. Yeah, ran across the other bus, and now we're on this bus. So, thank goodness Lance did check. Um, but yeah, it's now quarter past four, so we've been on the bus for five hours, 15 minutes. And Google Maps says still about four hours to go in a normal car. And let me just tell you, we stop every 10 minutes to let someone on or off, even if it's in the middle of the random bush. Like, <laughs> every single place in the road if someone's standing we stop for them but i am dying for the toilet i need to go wee so bad and so i'm just hoping that we stop at the town sometimes <laughs> yeah well, i hope the rest of the trip is pregnant yeah It's 7 o'clock now and we are sitting in the dock. <laughs> We're dropping off another person. Um, but yeah, this bus looks like a party bus. <laughs> We have one hour to go. Okay, what's the time? It is 10 o'clock, so both of us were very wrong. <laughs> but I was close to this hour. No. We finally made it. <laughs> yep, finally made it. Not to get on the taxi. Yeah. <laughs> 11 hours. <laughs> We've got our tent. Woohoo! Hey, coming in. Like a tortoise. Made it, eh? Finally made it to Big Falls. Very tired. <laughs> <laughs> long, what, long. What do you have to say about our bus trip? So much fun. <laughs> <laughs> but we did it, and we survived, and we have memories, so. Yeah. All's good in the hood, and now it's time for bed. Yeah. And we've got a nice little cozy tent. My bed. Lance's bed. <laughs> good night. Good night.
Mom's got a bacon and egg roll. And I got pancakes. With a chocolate milkshake, of course. <laughs> Morning. Good morning. We are finally more bright and alive today after yesterday's <laughs> long bus ride. Bus ride, yeah. But we've just uh, gone ahead and booked our activities for tomorrow. So we've gone with the general and janky package. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go do the flying fox, uh, zip line, and the gorge swing. The gorge swing. Yeah. So I convinced Lance to finally do it with me. So that's going to be very cool. We paid what, $155 each, each. And normally they like $120 for each thing, or like 80. So it added up, we got such a big discount. Um, so very excited for that. Yeah, tomorrow. and then in the afternoon, we're going to go for a sunset boat cruise. Yeah. Yeah, now we're on our way. We're walking towards the yep. rainforest. So we're going to go have a look yep. at the viewpoints and yeah. look at the falls from Zimbabwe side. Yeah. <laughs> We've made it to the rainforest. Just need to pay our coffees and we can go inside. Yep. Okay, we've come to South Africa to show you the passports. We paid $40, uh, yeah, 20, 20 each, yeah. because we the SADAC, or I don't know how you say that, but yeah. South African <laughs> passport. Um, so we got slightly less, the international yeah. is $30 each. And then if you're local Zimbabwean, then it's $7. Yeah. So we're in and we've just started the walk through the rainforest. Should take us two to three hours. So we're going to stop off at each of the viewpoints. Victoria Falls is one of the seven natural wonders of the world, with the traditional name of Mosi Watunya, which is taken from the Lozi language and means the smoke that thunders. What a perfect name, as all you can hear is the roaring sound of the water while watching the smoke, or mist, shoot up as it hits the bottom. In terms of height, Victoria Falls measures 107 meters tall, which is double Niagara Falls. Its width is the 10th largest at 1.7 kilometers wide, and volume is 13th largest. But when combining all three factors, Victoria Falls is the largest curtain of falling water in the world. This majestic waterfall spans into two countries. 75% of it is visible from the Zimbabwean side, and the other 25% from the Zambian side. The low 
water levels are during November-December and the peak season is during April-May when the water levels are at their highest with roughly 600 million litres of water cascading every minute. This volume produces a spray that rises 1,650 feet into the air. So yes, make sure you bring a rain jacket. You will get soaked. <laughs> So this is the after. <laughs> we got absolutely drenched. <laughs> oh my gosh, so we thought these were rain jackets. Turns out they were windbreakers. <laughs> yeah, they really didn't keep us dry at all. I think it's impossible to stay dry here. Yeah. Probably. But oh my word, hey? Yeah, that so was beautiful. incredible. Must, must, must see. Definitely. Oh my word, that was amazing. Now I can see why it's one of the seven wonders of the world. So stunning. The spray from the falls creates 24-7 rain every single day of the year and blesses the area with the most beautiful, lush greenery. The Victoria Falls Rainforest is the only place in the world where it rains all day, every day. How amazing! Groceries. We got some chocolate for Nutro. We've got a Tupperware so that we can eat out of all we'll take turns. And some long enough milk. Yeah. And some spoon. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, so we just got breakfast for the rest of the week. We got chocolate Nutro like we showed you. And everything came to $12.80. 12 yeah. So yeah, that's one way to save money. <laughs> Well, especially because this morning our, um, our breakfast was $13, 13 I think. Yeah, for so coffee and yeah, pancakes and, and a uh, bacon sandwich. <laughs> It's date night. <laughs> it's date night. We're going to try and find a cheap place. For some food. Yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> everything is so bloody expensive. Yeah. Prices are definitely a little bit inflated here in Vic Falls. Yeah. Yeah, price. Also, we're trying to keep an eye out for any wild animals because we've been told that this town is actually in the middle of a game reserve. Yeah. Apparently, they have some... Or national parks. Yeah. Actually. Elephants and rhino. I not rhino. Um, hippos yeah, come walk through so town. Bad. So yeah, gonna be interesting. Yeah, very. Yeah. 